Well, welcome back. Hey, everybody. Axon Ronder here, and welcome back to another episode of Super Mario Brothers 6... Super Mario 64. Super Mario Brothers 64? No, Super Mario 64. Anyways, on the last episode, we got five additional stars from one of each level, practically. And now we're on our way to see this shining light. I don't know where... It, I know where it leads. You know what? Let's just jump into it. If you look up... <gasps> You get transported flying. You can fly in this game with uh, with the power of the wing cap. Now, it says right here, I'm not going to explain it because I don't know if the song kind of times in. So it's just basically telling you you can fly. So what we're supposed to do, if you see in the bottom right, there's red coins. We need to collect those red coins. Will I fail this quest? Maybe so. So let's see how much we can get these red coins. Here we go. Three, two, one. Go. Ooh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, we messed up so bad so bad but it's fine it's fine as long as we get these as long as we start just take it nice and easy the only problem is mario likes to kamikaze all around the area so just be careful and you'll be able to get these stars now if you'd like do that jump like i did in the beginning it should help out because it kind of like stabilizes mario five six two more come on just two more can't mess this up <laughs> mario hit the dog mario oh Oh, let me catch my breath. <laughs> you stepped on the wing cap switch. Wearing in the wing cap will now ser uh, send you to the sky. Now wing caps will pop out in the red blocks you find. Would you like to save? Yes, sir. As you can see, these are the red caps. And you'll be seeing these across the worlds. And there's one of these in World 1. So now that we have this and that, Here we, go. we can now go complete World 1. Oh, yay. So, this is where I want to take things a little bit different. I have now 11 stars. Now, I could go fight the boss. And I can unlock even more levels. And that will create even more problems for me. <laughs> but I do want to collect as many hats as possible. That's the secret to little knickknacks we get to use as hats. We got one out of three. So, what I want to do is I think I'm going to go fight Bowser. And then we're going to go unlock the second cap. Reacting to the star power, the door slowly opens. Ooh! Oh, look, the princess is there. <gasps> no, it's Bowser. Whoa, ha, ha, ha. Sorry, I didn't mean to do that. You step right into my trap. As you know... I'm just as I knew you would. I warn you, friend. Watch your step. Okay, so this is a pretty uh, scary area, if you can say so myself. This is Bowser in the Dark World. So what we're supposed to do is that we're supposed to complete this level and defeat Bowser. Simple as that. We're almost done with the game, right? Uh, another thing we're supposed to do is that if you saw right there, there's red coins. Eight in each level. And we're supposed to get that because there are stars in this real level, too. Oh no, Mark! Mamma mia! Oh, there goes the first death of the game. Just when I thought I was like, oh, I'm doing pretty good. I'm no deaths in this game. Well, spoke too soon on that one. Now I could edit. I could edit that and be like, oh yeah, we're starting this, but I'm, I'm a terrible liar. We'll just take things nice and slow. Okay, don't mess this up. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine, we're doing good. Kinda. Not the best, but we're doing good. Get this one, get this one, get this one. <sighs> Those two are the, probably the more nerve-breaking ones, so after that, it's smooth sailing. I say that, and I feel like I'm already jinxed myself. <laughs> As you can see, like, this level is... Whoa! Whoa, there we go. This level is kind of all over the place compared to the first couple ones. Well, the other ones were like on somewhat more stable ground. This one is kind of like just a giant staircase going up. Keep, be careful with those. Uh, yeah, they do that. They shock you. And they kind of like immobilize, so they kind of give you all their vault or like their shock. And uh, what we're supposed to do is kind of like just wait along. Just, just time your jumps and you should be fine. Keep an eye out for red points because they like to appear in like different areas. Mario! Mamma mia! 
Mario, what was that? Didn't I just tell you to be careful? That's two for two! Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm not... Uh, uh, okay, just let's just take this nice and slow, like we did last time. Okay, if, I, if you hear me being quiet, I apologize for that. I'm, this is not a hard level for me to get through these red coins. I've done it about 100 times, but I've always told myself, the more I play this game, the more I feel like I'm getting worse at it each time. It's supposed to be the other way around, but no, no, not for me at least. Okay, so we jump here, jump there. I always miss that. I used to be able to time that properly, but I guess if you're just moving too fast, or not fast, but reckless, you, you won't make the jump. This is supposed to be a quick and simple. We're supposed to get two stars in this world, or in this uh, in this episode. That's getting this star, and then the metal cap. That should be that simple. Should be. Can't mess this up. There we go. You can't mess that up. I mean, you see, there's one over there. You can jump over there and get it. You're probably wondering, like, why did you do that if you're having a hard time with that thing moving? It's like, I, I don't know. Oh, no, no! Mm, you see? You see what happens when you decide to be stupid? Okay, we'll be back. Mamma mia. Okay, so we're back. Um, I, 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 This level's not hard. It shouldn't be this hard. I don't know why I'm failing so bad, but uh, that, that's just the way the cookie crumbles, apparently. Come on, Mario. We can't mess this up again. We already failed like five times. We gotta show at least we're decent at this game. Oh my gosh. I've never died so much in this level before. I, I had eight. I think eight. I've died four times. Four times. I've... That's ridiculous. Oh. Just take it slow, Mario. Okay, there we go. So, we got what? One, two, three, four, five, six red coins, and we got to get ourselves an additional two. So it's not too hard. We're almost done. Just take things slow. Don't don't mess it up. Please don't mess it up, Mario. Wait a minute. Oh, yeah, don't worry. I'm right. I'm right. Okay. It's because, like, when I practiced this, I was like, oh, I'm doing so good. I feel like I can, I'm real confident about this. And then as soon as I start, as soon as I hit that record button, as soon as I hit it, like, oh, no bueno. Okay, so what you can do is that you can climb up there and then you'll be able to get up. But I like to wall jump up here because it's simpler. And um, what we're supposed to do is that we're supposed to get that red coin over there. Now, you can't really jump this one because I don't know why. You can jump over here, but you can't jump over there. So what I like to do is that I like to push these things up, run, and then jump on this one. And then get the last coin. And we get a star! Yay, a star! We jump up here, and then jump up right here, and then we long jump over here. Oh! Why did that not... Oh! Hit the switch, climb the stairs, and get the star. Oh my goodness, that was probably the most... That was really bad. <laughs> Let's just fight Bowser. Oh. Tough luck, Mario. Princess Toadstool isn't uh, Princess Toadstool isn't here. Qua ha ha. Go ahead, try to grab me by my tail and you swing me around. Yada yada yada. Okay, so like he said, we're supposed to grab him, swing him around. So well, there you go, you grab him. And then where are you supposed to swing him around? Well you see those spike balls right there? What we're supposed to do is that we're supposed to swing him towards the spike balls. You just time it, release, and then he's hit. Simple as that. And we're done with the game. Oh, well, actually, no. He said that the princess was in another, another part of the castle, so uh, so got a long way to go. Grr, I was a bit careless. This is not as I planned, but I still have pulled the power of the stars, and I still have Peach. Wahaha, ha, ha, you will what? You'll get no more stars from me. I'm not finished with you yet, but I'll let you go for now. You'll pay for this later. Thank you. 
Now we got ourselves a key. Ooh, and we cleared that after several failed attempts. So, like I said, we were two things we we're supposed to do in this level is that get that, uh, <laughs> get the defeat Bowser and get to the second cap. So this key opens up the basement, which is a, a shoe full levels. I think I said that right. And what's cool about this is that I feel these levels are a little bit more, well, they are more advanced, but uh, they're a lot more uh, terrifying, for example. I mean, I don't know. You'll, you'll see that in a bit. So what we want to do is go over here to this one. And you can see there's a lot of pipes here. What are these pipes? What is, where, where are we? And then if you look down here, you see this. I don't know what that is. Judging by these pipes, I'm assuming I know what that is, but I'm not going to say what that is. I'm hoping it's something else. Oh, I really hope it's something else, but I'm, I'm not going to assume it. So, as you can see, we have a toad. Hold on to your hat. If you lose it, you'll be injured easily. If you lose your cap, you'll have to find it in the course where you lost it. Oh boy, it's not looking good for Peach. She's still trapped somewhere in the walls. Please, Mara, you have to help her. Do you, did you know that there are enemy worlds inside the walls? Yup, it's true. Bowser troops are there too. Oh, here, take this. I've been keeping it for you. Oh, cool. Here we go. Well, at least you kept it safe for me. That's another one of the castle secret stars, and there's like three toads that have three stars, so keep that in mind. So this episode's not a complete failure. Okay, so if we want to get to the second cap, actually, I think we can do both of them. I think that would be a great way to end this episode if we get both caps and that will be able to unlock all the areas we can go to in this world. That way this episode is not a complete lost. So, let's just uh, jump into the pool of uh, stuff. Hazy Maze Cave, Swimming Beast in the Cavern. Now, we could do this level. We could, but we're not. Uh, th this is an interesting... I like this concept. Uh, in the first the first cap, we were able to... Was able there... Was... Speak. <laughs> was given to us through a, through a level. In this one, it's, e it's, it's interesting because the cap... The second cap that was... Oh, by the way, this is so we can gain HP. Uh, the second cap is located in level. It's the only cap that does this. It's, it's quite interesting. There we go. And avoid the... They're, they're magnetized towards you. I don't know why. But avoid the Indiana Jones rocks. You go over here. And what's cool about this level is that you can you can see like there's maps all around. It's like, you're right here. And, it, and the maps never really helped, really. Uh, I never bothered using them. I think like the very first time when I played this, and that was like when I was five, I started using the map, but that didn't really help out. Okay, just making sure it's something. As you see, that we're supposed to get to that door over there, but how do we get to that door? There's like a... There's like a... There's no ledge. Well, what we're supposed to do... And if you saw him already... There's a plesiosaur! Honestly, this scared me when I was a kid. Could you imagine swimming in a lake and a dinosaur appears out of nowhere? No, this way. Now, what's interesting, as soon as you get on his back, he starts moving to where your head is pointing. So as long as you point in a specific direction, Mario will go there. So keep that in mind. Now, this is the sucky part. Well, maybe I don't have to do it. No, 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 no. Sorry, 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 sorry. Uh, if you need him, stop. You're going to have to ground pound him. He stops. And then you can get on his head. And then you're there. Sorry about that. I didn't really mean to ground pound you, but you're, that's the only way to get him stop. Now you can try to climb on his head normally, but it's a lot slipperier. Slipperier. Slippery? It's slippery. Just jump into the slime. Welcome to the metal cap switch course. Once you step on the metal on the cap switch, you'll be the green blobs will become solid. So as you can tell, this is not poo. This is metal. We're covered in metal. We are now known as. Uh, Metal Mario and in this state we're practically invincible. However, it only lasts not that long I think like 30 some seconds, maybe a little bit less, maybe a little bit more I'm not too sure the time, but as you can see there's this green switch and then there's a uh, red coin So we do get a star and we get ourselves a brand new upgrade There we go 
You stepped on the metal cap switch. The metal cap makes Mario invincible. Now metal caps will be pop out of the green blocks you find. Would you like to save? Yes. What's cool about this is that you can see the metal right here, so it is metal. And don't jump it. Don't you dare jump into the water because it will take you away and it will take you outside of the Peach's castle. What you want to do is get the cap. And when you're in water, you're well, you're literally metal, so you're heavy. So it's not like it's going to be able to take you away, which is pretty cool. Got seven. They're all around here, so don't, don't think like, oh, no, where are they? But do move fast. Because uh, you will lose the thing. So congratulations, you got 14 stars if you're following along. If you are, I'm sorry. Okay, so one more star on my list is a little bit out of here. I wonder if our friend's going to appear now because... Let's see, is he going to appear? No, I think it's at 16 stars. Uh, we're going to see a little friend of ours. So what we want to do is jump into this nice clean water. I don't think it's water because it connects to the moat outside, so I, I, I'm, I'm assuming it's clean. Don't think about it too much. And you're going to come across like these two pillars here. Now the sign right there tells you like, oh, you got to find a way to drain the lake. But well, this is a weird draining system, so you just hit this one. And then hit this one. And then the water just magically drains and... It just disappears. You don't know where it goes. It's, it's just water. The water's gone. The lake's reduced the size, too. You can still swim in it, but the water's completely gone. But thanks to that, we're able to go into this crack on the floor. And where does this crack on the floor lead us? Uh, don't ask me where. Welcome to the Vanish Quick, the vanish Cap switch. Okay, so this is the third cap, which is a Vanish Cap, which basically makes us uh, see-through, but also invincible as well. But we're able to go through... Uh, enemies and phase through certain walls. It's pretty cool. Now we're gonna have to like descend the slide and I, I know what you're thinking like why don't you just slide? Excuse me. Um, There are red coins on the slide and I don't want to and I don't want to miss them. So I'm just taking my time on them and once you have what is it the four here you're able to go through. Ground bound here so you don't slide off. Be careful with the bombs, or like these fire things. There's, there's a lot of them in this area, and they just want to try to stop you. See right there. Okay, this is the fun part. So I may fail here again. Um. So. There we go. That's just uh, safe for precautions. Don't worry about that. I'm going to jump right here. Then get to here. Uh-oh. I missed that jump. Wait for it, wait for it. Jump right here. Just take your time on it. Don't 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 be like too fancy. Jump right here. And what I like to do is I like to get back here and then do a long jump. Or not uh, like a backflip. And not only do we get a beautiful star, we also get a blue cat. We get the vanished star cat, which you like to save? Yes. Now, remember when I said, like, the Vanish Shark Cap allows us to go through walls? So, if we go, we touch this, we can't go through this wall, so we need the, the cap. Luckily for us, there's one right here. And, we'll be able to go through this wall easily and get our star. Here we go! Yahoo! Yay, we got ourselves... Well, that was actually really productive. We beat Bowser. We got three additional stars, oh, four additional stars, and we got ourselves, um, what's the word? Did we get four stars? How many stars we got? We got Bowser star, one, two, no, we only got three stars. We got Bowser stars and then these two hat stars. So we only got, yeah, there's three stars. All right, jump. I feel, hey! You know what? Let's try to catch this bunny, and then we'll, we'll, I think we'll call it for this episode. Because I think that's a decent amount of stuff for us to do. Now, if you're probably wondering, why are we chasing this bunny? Well, this bunny has a star, and this bunny is very annoying. So what I like to do is I try to be careful with it, and then I jump. I caught him. Normally, that takes me a long time. Yow! Unhand me, brute. I'm late. I'm so late. I must make haste. The shiny thing, mine. It's mine. Finders, keepers, losers. Late, late, late. Ouch. Take it, then. It was a gift from Bowser. 
He gave you this? It's mine now. And with that, we got 16 stars. And that's another of the secret power stars. Now, keep an eye on him. He does come back. So, we'll, we, we'll be back later. Cool, 16 stars in our pocket. That's not bad for a decent amount of recording time. So, we still got the upstairs um, floors to finish. So, I think that's where I'm going to head off there. I, I don't want to do the bottom floors just yet because it's... um. I don't want to do the bottom floors just yet because, like, it's a... Uh, yeah. I, I don't want to spread myself so thin. So we're going to head up back stairs. And ignore that for now. Scary. <laughs> this place is haunted. And we'll tackle these stars. We'll try to finish all the star, all the stars upstairs. And then we'll finally tackle the uh, basement. But I think we're going to call it here because um, I... I may be recording for a long time, so if this episode's a little bit short, I apologize for that. Um, I'll try to time these a little bit more, uh, what is it, efficiently, so we can have decent episodes, but at reasonable time limits. So, I hope you guys had a wonderful time watching me fail in the first level of Bowser's fight. So, hopefully I don't, I don't mess up on the next episodes, or in the next fights like that. And, um... Yeah, take you guys uh thank you guys for watching. Take care of yourselves and I will see you on the next episode. Bye-bye.